Hi, I'm Steve Moon. I'm from Moon Air Incorporated, located in Elkton, Maryland, on the beautiful Eastern Shore, servicing uh, our area for over 25 years. We provide heating and air conditioning services on all makes, models of equipment, and that's very different. Well, everybody says that, but in our area, we have many different types of equipment. And the inspector's most wonderful invention that I've found in my 35 years in this industry. My name is Tom O'Connor. I'm the inventor and patent holder of a thing called the inspector camera. It's an infrared video inspection camera that snakes up on the inside of furnaces to test what they call the heat exchanger or the combustion chamber. When I was taught by my father to inspect these things, that he gave me a flashlight and a mirror and he was like, go for it, son. And you, you're looking for blowback, you're looking for all these little things. But the technology wasn't there to really do a CAT scan on the furnace. And that's what the inspector does. Uh, the reason that's important is because it's really critical to know if there's any holes or cracks in a heat exchanger because the heat exchanger is what separates the combustion gases and carbon monoxide from the household air. So it's critically important that the heat exchanger be sound, be intact, and uh, be unquestioned, not have any holes or cracks. Over 270 people are gonna die this winter from heat, carbon monoxide and poisoning. That comes from a failure in your furnace. That could have been caused by a dirty filter, it could have been caused by a lot of things. But the inspector really gives us the ability to CAT scan your, your heat exchanger, find obvious issues, and find things that are not obvious that less expensive technology of the day uh, won't even show up. In fact, the American Gas Association, who is the authority over furnaces, their sticker has to be on every furnace sold in the United States, uh, states that any visible crack is reason for requiring replacement of the heat exchanger or the furnace. Uh, it's not a suggestion, it's a requirement. So it's critically important uh, to know if your furnace is safe for you and your family. Not every crack is going to be an, uh, an urgent catastrophe, but there's no other way of knowing other than visual inspection, and that's what the American Gas Association requires. I drive a Cadillac, okay? That's how I live my life. My tools are Cadillac tools, and the inspector should have a Cadillac symbol on it, because I think that's about as good as it gets. Customer service is what life is about. I am in the customer service business. I just show it off by fixing a little heat and air conditioning once in a while. It was time for our annual furnace tune-up, and I had never been home when um, they come to do that. Usually my husband takes care of that, and uh, they brought a camera, an inspector camera, and I had never seen anything like this. And they went in and they inspected our furnace, they showed me the heat exchanger and what it looked like and they found a crack. And they told us that, that was we couldn't run the furnace at all. We had two options, either change the heat exchanger or we replace the furnace. So we replaced the furnace and we didn't have to worry about it and it was a good thing that we caught it on time because it could have been really dangerous for our family. And my people truly care. I mean, it comes out in every one of my team. Everybody on my team are special. They're the all-American individuals. They're clean cut, they're drug free, they've got no criminal background. You're comfortable with them. And they come into your home to service you and listen to you. And then they'll fix your heat and air conditioning. So I went into my laundry room and there I saw water on the floor and I sopped it up, put the load in, went and finished up and when I came back, there was like a huge puddle where I had just sopped up the water. They came out and they assessed the problem, but when they came to, when I went to the door, I was surprised that they had a name tag on and I could tell it was the right company that I called. And they put shoe covers on and they went and looked at the water heater and assessed with the camera that they use. I think it's called like the inspector, he said. And they went underneath the water heater and he showed me on his monitor screen that there was like flakes of rust coming off of the bottom. He said I was very fortunate the whole bottom just didn't break open and leak out the water. 
while I was gone. So he turned off the water, called his office, I guess, and they came back out within an hour and I, within two, two and a half hours, I had a new water heater and I was so happy with that. Because we look to protect people. I mean, that's my job. You don't know who you are. So it's up to me to, to protect you from all the, the bad guys in the heat air conditioning world. They walked me through what the problem was. They showed me what the problem was. They really took the time to educate me. It really made me feel good about the decision that I had made. You expect to turn that key, walk in the door, and be comfortable. That is an American expectation. When that doesn't work, you're mad at somebody. And you're usually mad at the guy that's coming to help you. The inspector allows you to find this before it happens. No one brings it to the market the way we do. If you call my company, how the phone is answered will set the tone for the experience that you're gonna have.